Sweat it to the truth, nothing but the truth. Put my hands on the Bible, y'all put me to the booth. Sweat it to the truth. So let's check out the recent interview with Demar Hamlin and Michael Strahan. When you're 24, peak physical condition, could run circles around me right now. <laughs> <laughs> How did doctor describe what happened to you? Um, um, that's something I want to stay away from. I know. Now there is no doubt in my mind that what happened on that field has everything to do with the we all know what. Can't say it due to being uh, censored or blocked or shadow banned or however they operate with that thing now. So you definitely have to be mindful and limited of what you say on here. But there is definitely no doubt in my mind that everything, everything leads back to that. We have a young man who's 24 who goes into uh, cardiac arrest on the field. <clears throat> and if anybody will want to know the statistics of that, when I went to go do, go do my research, the statistics show that about 2,000 people under the age of 25 a year uh, go into or would suddenly die of uh, sudden cardiac arrest. Now, a person might think, oh, that's a big number. You may not. But if you want to put that into perspective, the statistics show up. There is over. There's roughly about 100 million people that's under the age of 24 here in America alone. And so the likely chances of anybody under the age of 25 to go into cardiac arrest was a 0 0.00002 chance. And then you have an athlete at the age of 24 who's at peak performance, who I would argue would eat well and work out constantly, just so happens to go into cardiac arrest I think not but there is most definitely something going on whether it's in regards to that possibly be a lawsuit you know I heard people mentioning that which I which I thought was definitely uh interesting it could definitely be that or it could definitely be just in fear of afraid of being talked about simply because we're in a time now to where a lot of things are being censored. A lot of things aren't being touched up on. A lot of important matters and situations are not being touched up on and talked about. Of course they wouldn't. And so of course they wouldn't tell us the truth about what it would do. You know what I'm saying? What it could possibly, what it could possibly cause or what, you know, what could be, what could be the, uh, consequences or effects or effects of this of this thing who believe again i do believe again with my whole heart that it has everything it has everything to do with that why would he not want to talk why would he not want to talk about what the, how the doctors describe how the doctors described it you know it's just too iffy it's just too iffy for me it's just a lot of it's a lot of blank spaces in there um that's not being filled. That's not that's not being filled in. But let me know what y'all think before I go. You see, we got new merch out. Truth matters. It most definitely does, especially here on this channel. That's why I empower you. I empower you with the truth with anything, with anything that I say. I look to um I look to keep it 100 at all times, not being biased or preferential or putting out my putting out my opinion. When it definitely comes to serious matters, I am, I am, I always look to tell the truth. But down there in the description box, click that link. Peace. I love y'all. I'm out. Tell the truth, nothing but the truth. Put my hands on the Bible, y'all. Put me to the booth. Sweat it to the